A common error in time value calculations is to round your interest rate without realizing that you're doing it. So in this video, we will cover how to avoid that error. So let's take a look at a mortgage, but let's not worry too much about the variables. Let's focus on the rounding. So on a mortgage, you typically have 25 years and you pay monthly, so your end is going to be 25 times 12. Let's say your interest rate is 5%, but again, you're paying monthly, so we're going to divide by 12. In this video, we'll ignore the effect of uh, compound interest and having to convert the rate. Let's say that you're borrowing $300,000. What's your monthly payment going to be? Well, let's enter this into the calculator, and we'll do it the correct way. So we're going to start with the end, so 25 years times 12 payments gives you 300 months. Let's enter that for our N. For my IY, watch how I do this, and you can back up the video if you need to. 5 is my interest rate, divide by 12 to make it monthly, equals, and I immediately press the IY key. The error would be to write down 0.4167 and re-enter this as the IY. And why would you do that when the calculator, you can just press the button. So why would you enter it, write it down, and then enter it again? What you don't realize is that even though the calculator displays 0.4167, the calculator has stored 0.4166 repeating. So the calculator actually has the unrounded number. If you write it down on a piece of paper and re-enter it, you've round it. Let's prove this. Let's continue with the question. 300,000, my present value, zero for future value. When you're done paying off the mortgage, you don't owe anything. And compute my, my payment. So I get 1753.77, and that would be the correct answer. 1753.77. Now, if you did this manually, you'd say 25 times 12 equals 300. You'd say 5 divided by 12 equals 0.4167. If you entered that into your calculator, you would get 1753.84, and that is the incorrect answer. We don't want that. I want 1753.77. That is the correct answer. Yes, it is only seven cents. So in this example, doesn't make a huge difference. In some examples, it will. 